Yo, what up family? Welcome back to the channel. So Focus Marketing and Promotions, Tech and Lifestyle channel. I'm your host, Mr. I'm So Focused. All right, what we got today, we got the third installment of the Goodwill Pickups. Um, these videos been rocking. Um, I'm liking how the video's going, so we're gonna keep rocking out with the videos. Um, so next up, we probably do some in-store videos. And uh, if you've been following me on Instagram, you've seen that um, yesterday I posted up Models is closing. Um, I think they last day is Sunday. So I was there today, I picked up some stuff. Um, obviously I was looking up for some stuff to flip. This is not even what this video is about, but I just I'm gonna just throw it in there. So if you could, if you have a chance, tomorrow, Saturday where I'm at, Sunday, Sunday their last day. They didn't really have a lot of stuff in there. They had mostly like, you know, baseball cleats, baseball pants, baseball bats. So, um, like I said, not really a lot of stuff, but the prices are crazy. So you get 80% off, 70% off. When you get to the register, you get an extra 10% off. So I picked up four items, but I actually picked up five items, but two items is on personal use. And um, these other four, these other four items I'm gonna show you real quick. There's actually six items. I went to two different model stores. I picked up uh, three. Well, three and three. So whatever. It is what it is. Six items total. Like I said, they don't have a lot of stuff in stores where I'm at. I only went to two. Um, a lot of baseball stuff, a lot of baseball cleats, a lot of baseball pants, bats, um, you know, and, ran and random stuff, you know. But you might find some things in there that you might like. And they also selling store fixtures. So if you're into that type of stuff, go there before Sunday. Knock yourself out. If you're an online seller, there's some stuff there for you. They got baseball gloves, um, helmets, um, whatever. So I got this today. It's a, uh, you know, football type, uh, football padding, whatever y'all call it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not into sports, so I don't even really rock out like that. But I knew this was expensive. So it didn't have a tag on it. It's by um, Riddle or Rydell, however you say that. Y'all see that right there? So I bought it to the register. Rang up. $10.99. Remember that price. $10.99. Rydell um, Combine, um, it's an extra large, Combine SK extra large, 50 inch or 52 inch, whatever that means, and you know it's the, it's the um, football pattern, alright, so ring up 1099, so I looked it up, and I was like, alright, let me bring it to the register, see how much it is, they was giving 80% off, the cashier rang it up at $10.99 or actually I think it was $16.99, so $17. So I looked it up and um, this is what I came up with. So um, it's the Riddle Combine and check out the price on this. This is what I'm telling y'all how, how these flips go. So right now selling at Dick's um, and some other stores, but peep the price on that. 209 bucks so that that right there is exactly what I got for $17 and check the price out on that so that flip is gonna be crazy when that sells same exact one so it's called the right or riddle varsity combine skill football shoulder pads all right can't go wrong with that 209 bucks all right 17 turn into at least on the low end, I'll get like 160 out of it, 175 out of it. Can't beat that. That flip is crazy. All right. So, um, also what I got, like I said, they got bats. So I got these three bats, Easton, USA. Um, this one was like $49. Came out to like um, 15 bucks. Um, this one too was 49. Came out to 15 bucks. It's the same one. And then this one was 60 bucks, but it rang up 18. Came up to 18. Um, these are the sizes. So, and when I looked up those Eastern bats, each, 
you see the prices on them. So, uh, you know, I'm going to try to clear $125 on all three of those bats. All right? So, whatever. That was just, you know, like I said, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that uh, Models is closing. Long time, you know. I used to shop at Models back in the days when I was a kid. That's when my mom used to take us to um to get um school um school um school sneakers to go back to school. That's the memory I have of that. You know what I'm saying? We went downstairs, thirty nine ninety nine, got our sneakers for school, and we was out of there. All right. So, big shout out to you know all the flippers, eBay, eBay sellers, Craigslist, Macari. Um, let go, offer up, all those people. If you're looking for some deals, hit up Models before Sunday. And, you know, go do your thing. All right? All right, back into the video. This one is the third installment of the Goodwill um, lineup. So, um, this one right now, I got 13 items. Um, we're going to go through them real quick. If you didn't watch the other two videos, actually, before we start anything... I'm going to take five seconds out right now. Actually, more, a little less than five seconds. I want you to click that thumbs up button. I want you to click the subscribe button. And I want you to click the notification button. All right? So click the thumbs up, click subscribe, and click the notifications button so you can see when my videos come out. I'm going to take this brief pause real quick. Hit me up. Do that real quick for me. All right, we back in. Let's do it. Let's get into these items. 13 items. If you haven't watched the other two videos, um, this is how we do it. I go through the items, tell you the potential flip. Um, I'll add them up, up, add them up on the calculator. Um, so we're going to see how much I spent at the end. And we're going to see what the potential flip is on all of the products. I wanted to knock these items out. I was going to shoot this video for next week. But I want to knock this out so I can um, post this stuff. Um, so I can get them up on the... Um, on all the websites so I can, you know, try to flip these things quick. All right, let's get into it real quick. First thing up, we got, this might be just for parts only, but what we got, we got a Crux Espresso Maker. Crux Espresso Maker. Came with the little, you know, the little thing on the, on the bottom, whatever. It's brand new, but it's missing a piece at the top right there. It's missing this piece that goes right inside right here where my, where my finger's pointing at. It is what it is, but it works. Plugged it in, steams up, it's brand new, mint. So something like this will probably sell for parts if somebody need it for parts. So that's the cups maker. Right there, Polly. That that right there goes for about, um, I believe I saw it for uh, 125 online. Um, I obviously with all of the pieces together, but, um, let me look it up real quick and show you. Krups Espresso Machine. Uh. So this was it, right? Actually, it's going for a little bit cheaper now, but these are the prices that I saw. You got 35, you got 110 on Etsy, you got 40, um... You got 40, 52, 60. All right, so I'm going to go for 40 on that. So we're going to keep it at 40 for that real quick. So um, hold on. Let me do the old school pen and paper thing so we can line it all up after we finish. And uh, we can rock out like that. So the first item up, crush machine, we're going for 40 bucks. All right, so next up, what we got right here, this is a prime example. If you see like an item, like a random item, pick it up and look at the bottom. I pay $1.99 for this. So some things might have like, you know, numbers on the bottom. And when you do that, when you see numbers on the bottom like that, always look up those numbers. So this one is 4149X and it says $1.99. That's how much I pay for it. So... You go to your phone, like I tell y'all, always have your phone out if y'all are going to be into this. And you go, you look up real quick, and right in the, in the search bar at the top, you just type it. 4149X. 
Um, hold on, let me erase this other thing real quick. So, 4149X. And you look it up, and this is what this is what pops up. So remember, it was one ninety nine. I paid for it. So this is it's a planter. So sixteen seventy six. This person is asking with nine dollars shipping. So that's about twenty five bucks. All right. Let me see. This is the actual one. I think I got right here. That's going for four dollars plus eight on the shipping. So thirteen bucks. You know, it's a collectible from 19, 1976. Same exact one I got. People love old stuff like this. All right? So just check it out. Look for those numbers. And you never know what you might be holding in your hand. All right? So right here, I'm going to ask. I'm going to be um, reasonable about it. And I'm going to ask 10 bucks for it. You know? Because I don't want to hold on to it for a long time. So we're going to put down 10 on the paper. So we up to 50 bucks right now. All right? So right here, next up, we have a helmet. It has some stickers on it. I found it kind of cool or whatever. So, you know, you got your kids riding bikes and stuff like that outside. That's the model number. That's the um, brand. So this ain't going to be. And it's the GoPro. So you can hook your GoPro up to it. You know, skateboarding, bike riding, um, scooters. For the kids or whatever, got a whole bunch of stickers on it, so it's cool. All right, this ain't, this I'm gonna ask five bucks for. All right, so we're gonna go. Oh, you see the price that I spent for it, two ninety nine. I might put, I might ask, you know, seven or eight, but I'm gonna be reasonable. And just put five dollars right now. We got a lot more stuff coming. All right, so five bucks. And we're moving on. All right, so right here, we got this thing called the Rope Light by Sunbeam. I paid $7.99 for it. You can see that right there. So it's called the Rope Light by Sunbeam. This this is going to be a personal use. I'm not going to sell this. I'm going to put this up in the backyard under the deck. So we can have the light. So I can have the lights out there. You see how it lights up right there. And it's multi multicolored also. I don't know if y'all can see that. All those lights in there. It's multicolored. It's 18 feet. Um, it expands up to 150 feet. Conforms to any shape. Creative lighting for parties, holidays, dorm rooms, and more. Uh, 20,000 hours. So, $7.99, you can't go wrong. So, this I'm keeping this. All right? So, we're not even going to add that up. Next up. Paid um, $7.99 for this. This is actually a keeper also. It's a, um, a towel bar for your bathroom. So I needed this. So I was like, you know what? In stores, this thing is probably like Bed Bath & Beyond or something like that. You're going to want to spend like $30 for this. Maybe a little less, $25. But $7.99, like I said, Goodwill store, man. They got the they got the bargains in there. Go check them out. It's a 24-inch towel bar. So I'm going to be keeping this. All right? So we're not adding that up. All right, so next up, this is gonna be a flip. It's a golf towel. A lot of people in my area, they play golf. This one was um, $4.99. This is from the Acme collection. Back in the days, Looney Tune Acme collection. I seen this posted online for 20 bucks. So that's exactly what I'm asking for, 20 bucks. All right? Got the um, Tasmanian Devil on it. And it's a golf towel. Well, if somebody want to use it for their bathroom, they could do that. It's a little staining in there, but it's brand new. $4.99. 20 bucks. All right? Um, let's get $20 down on the paper. So next up. Uh, yeah, let's do these. So I got four golf clubs here. Another thing, when y'all shopping around... Y'all got to look up the golf clubs. If you see any Goodwill in the Goodwill store, the golf clubs, always pull them out one by one and um, and look at the, you know, the, the, the writing on it because that's going to tell you exactly what they are, what they are and how much, they, how much they're worth. All right. This is like a kid's golf club. Each of these golf clubs, I paid um, $4.99 for each of them, but this one, um, 
think I remember this one is like an exclusive one right here because they got that wooden um I don't know handle whatever I don't play golf but you know you look up that writing right there I'm gonna ask 20 bucks for this one and I'm gonna ask um, 10 bucks for this one so that's 30 and then this one I'm gonna ask 10 40 and then this kids one is brand new in the packaging so I'm gonna ask 10 so we have 50 on the golf golf clubs. 20 and 30. All right? So we have 50 on the golf clubs. Remember, look up those golf clubs. Those golf clubs are expensive. Sometimes you might get a set. Sometimes you might get them with the whole bag. Once you get them separately, if you ever check on eBay, just type in golf clubs on eBay. Some of those things are worth $115, $140, $200 for one golf club. So you never know what you got, you might be holding in your hand. Always check out the golf club section in the Goodwill store. All right, so next up, we got a Mets bobblehead. I got this for $5.99. This one actually surprised me. This is um, $5.99. It's Mets, um, Todd Frazier. This was like a WWE. Hold on, let me, yeah, it's a WWE collaboration with the Mets. As you can see right there. So he's actually holding a, um, a championship belt. I don't know if y'all can see that. So that's, I guess that's Todd Frazier. Todd Frazier bobblehead. Got the uh, World Wrestling Federation. Todd Frazier bobblehead. That's him again on the side. All right. So Todd Frazier bobblehead Mets. Now, I didn't know nothing about Todd Frazier. I didn't know who he was. I don't watch sports like that. But what I did, um, I pulled out my phone and I looked up Todd Frazier WWE bobblehead. And this is what I well, this is what I came up with. Look at that. Look at that price. Remember, five ninety nine is what I paid for it. Fifty bucks plus shipping and handling. This person is asking for it, so that's sixty bucks. They pretty much asked it. Same exact one that I got. Same exact thing. All right. So eBay is always your friend on these things. Um, let me look it up again so we could go through a different some different ones. Um, see what kind of other prices they got here. So. They got $19.99, $19.99, 50 is the one that we was just looking at. Um, they got 10 out the box, $34.99, uh, 19 50 18 18 19 34 49 You see the prices. So I'm, a, I'm, I'm selling locally because I don't do eBay and um, I don't ship out. So I'm going to put 30 on it. Somebody come through with 20, they could take it. You know, hopefully you got a Todd Frazier fan and um, they could take it for 20, but I'm, I'm going to post it for 30. All right. So the last item we got, well, actually, this is two more items. So this item right here was $12.99. I didn't know what it was. I thought it was a regular bowling ball until I got it home. And um, it came in a bowling ball bag, obviously. So I might have to split this up. So I still got to do some research on it because I couldn't find anything about it. But it's like a Tiffany style color gumball. I looked up that number. If anybody knows what this is, you know, it's a, it got a gumball machine right there. I'm thinking it was a prop from a store, but it's not a, um, it's not a bowling ball because it doesn't have the holes that you put your fingers in. So... You know, it just said, it just, this is the only markers that it has. If anybody knows what that is, leave a comment in the section below. Let me know how much this is worth. I couldn't find nothing, but I only looked it up for maybe like 15 or 20 minutes. I got to still, you know, do some more research on it. But it says Gumball 8 Mary 71641. That's the number on it. I'm thinking it was, uh, you know, a prop from a, the Gumball store. You know, the, you know, so... This might be exclusive right here. I, I seen the Tiffany color through the bag, so I thought it was like a Tiffany style bait, um, bowling ball. That's exactly what I thought it was, but 
when I got it home, I checked it out, and that was it. All right, so I'm going to look that up. So I don't know. It's going to be unknown why I'm going to ask for that, but for the, for the bag itself, I think I'm going to ask $10 for the golf bag. Not Sorry, not golf, the bowling bag. The bowling ball bag. All right? Yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. All right, so now next up, this was the item of the day. So this was a Brohan, if that's how you say it, 655. So this is the bathroom. I don't want to drop it. It was a 655 ventilation fan and heat with light and heater for your bathroom. So you see that. I'm going to put it on the floor in a minute, but I want to try to see how much I paid for it. $14.99. All right? So is your fan, sound, light, heater, it's quiet. All right? So I want y'all to, I'm going to keep it right here. And I want y'all to see how much this thing goes for. I paid $14.99 for it. So it's the Brohan 655. Watch this, y'all. This is why you hit. The, this is why if you're doing the flips, you hit up the. Uh, you hit up the. The Goodwill store. And everything's in there, brand new. I'm gonna open it up for y'all after I show y'all to look it up. Um, after I look it up, I'm gonna show y'all the inside of the box. So Brohan. Uh, six fifty five. I always go to eBay because you know that's where you get the best comps at. So you can pretty much gauge what you're gonna charge for it. But like I said, this is what I'm charging. If you want to charge something else, you charge something else. That's on you. Um, hold on. Right, let me just look it up real quick. Brohan. All right, so this is it right here. So I paid spent fourteen ninety nine for it. So now look at the prices, y'all. Eighty four dollars, one hundred and ninety nine dollars, one hundred and four dollars, one hundred and two, one hundred and eight, ninety four, one twenty five, one eleven, one fifty two, ninety seven, or one hundred four, one hundred four, one twelve, ninety eight, ninety four. So on average. That, that's a $90 product right there on average. Let's see if y'all can see that. Go back up real quick. So y'all can see those prices. 84, 199, 104, 109, 102. This is, this is it right here. You know, y'all see the prices. 97, 104. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to ask something reasonable for this. I'm going to ask $80 for it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going for eighty dollars. So, so the the writing real quick. I wrote everything down. This is what we got so far on the numbers. So we got. Uh, remember, we're keeping two items. So this is the numbers that we got so far. We got um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, eight items. We had 13 total. Um, I didn't put the the helmet, you know, so, and I didn't put the towel. So right now, we're going to add all of this up. I didn't put a couple of items on there because remember some stuff I'm keeping. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 125, right? 125, um, 155, 165. Plus the 80. So that 165 plus the 80, 5, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So on this flip, on this right, on this last one right here, this is where we at, 245. All right? That's my flip, what I'm thinking I'm going to get off of everything after I sell it. All right? So here's what I spent for everything. And I always like, I, I didn't tell you.